Coming up on the other side of the break from Fort Worth, Texas, starting lineups, opening tip, the Horn Frogs and the Broncos. 7.7 assists. Down low to Mallory McGuire. Right-handed shot, no. And this is what Boise State was afraid of. TCU getting out on a quick break. Ray for three, knocks it down. Boy, that's just what they thought would happen. Deep in the corner, splash sister number one. Out front, Lauren Hurd, the junior out of Denton Geyer High School. In the corner, the three buried. Nothing but the bottom of the net by J.C. Bradley. Nice job defensively. Brad Brady Hodgins just stopping her cold. The three buried. That's probably welcome for her because the last four games she's been shooting only about 27%. Nice backdoor play. Jade Wood slips it and gets it. About a 10-second difference shot of the game clock here in the opening quarter, and they throw it away again. Ryan has the ability to get to the basket and score. See Pull right up there. Off the glass, count it. Boise with a second and a half to go. Christopher's not going to be able to do anything. Heard out front. In the corner, Bradley got it. That's a three. Went straight down to the bucket. Well, McGuire's got to step up. First four games, she had double digit scoring, none since then. Heard outside, the three goes down. Riley Lufer is in the lineup on the drive. Count it. Catching those errant passes, they were high, not catchable. But if those passes came down a little bit, it would have been a much closer game. Lauren Hurd knocks down another three, her third of the ball game. Coaches were telling me how much time they put in shooting free throws on the steal. Hurd, Christensen to beat and does. Mallory, great position inside. Mallory McGuire with the two. That's what we talked about in the open. The stingy defense. Okamalafe gets the home court bounce. Third quarter has been the only quarter in which the Horn Frogs have been outscored this season. But they start out forcing the turnover. Heard with the pick to the hole. Counted. And one. You know, if you get another foul, then, you, you know, at that point, you go sit down. But you still got to play with the same intensity. Looper got the three. The southpaw knocks it down. She even fell on the ground trying to make sure that Boise State did not get that rebound. And then Woods comes back and knocks down her first three of the evening. Heard, couple of dribbles, floats it over the outstretched hands of Mallory McGuire. And Boise going to their bench. One thing their bench has done this year is provided enthusiasm and McGuire from the outside. On the drive, count it. You know, being able to shut them down at what they're good at, that's the whole point of the scout. J.C. Bradley knocks down the three. Final 35 seconds of quarter number three. Warner deep in the corner, got it. Jade Christopher, four assists so far tonight, but she's got six turnovers. Boise does score. But being able to contain her, mm -hmm. more turnovers than she does have assists tonight. Another offensive rebound. Put back by Hurd. A couple times in this game. The three. Count it. Kiana Ray knocks down the tray. That's her second from beyond the arc. I didn't see it. Coach was standing in front of me. I didn't, I didn't really see it either. And then Boise answers with the three. Five minutes to play in the ball game. Kick it back out, the three by Michelle Berry. Hodgins keeping an eye on Hurd. Pull up jumper by Keanu Ray, count it, and center to the line. Hooley inside, got her first two as a horn frog. Bella the junior, also from Australia. TCU keeps their record perfect. They defeat Boise State once again the final 77-65.